it's time for some GCN Does Science in relation to helmets, retro versus modern. Which is cooler? And I mean, literally, that's the thermometer. We're going to do some temperature science. The helmets I'm going to be comparing today are these two. Now, first up, we have this from Rudy Project. This is the Rudy Project Freezer. Now, this really is a retro helmet. I actually used this back in 1998, so 18 years old, and really a thing of its time. It's got eight vents, and it was a combination between aerodynamics, as you can see, the really built up part at the back, coming to a point, and then these holes here, which they claimed at the time to make it one of the coolest and most aerodynamic helmets out there. It weighs in at 250 grams. And on the left here from Cask, another Italian manufacturer, we have the Protone. Weighs in at 215 grams, has 12 vents, and again is a combination of lightness, comfort, aerodynamics, and keeping your head cool. But which of these two helmets is gonna keep my head the coolest in these sunny conditions. We're talking about 30 degrees. Okay, run number one on the Arcalis climb. We're gonna climb for 20 minutes at a perceived effort level of around seven out of 10. Run number one is in the cask Protone. Wish me luck, it's a headwind too. There you go, that's it, that's the reading now. It should read. 32.6. It's pretty warm. It's wet, that's real. Okay, it's time for the Rudy Project freezer. So run number two up the brutal alcohol. I've had a little bit of a rest. I've had some sweets to get my sugar levels up. And now another 20 minute run in the Rudy Project freezer at perceived effort again of seven out of 10. Here we go. Ooh, wow, so that's 1.1 degrees warmer than the Protoni. Well, I've managed to get my head together after those two very difficult efforts. Remember, at altitude and the results are in. The temperature of my head underneath the cask Protone was 32.6 degrees. And on the run, with the Rudy Project freezer, it was 33.9 degrees. And by my calculation, that's a difference of 1.3 degrees. So the coolest helmet is the Cask Protone. But when you take a look at these two helmets and consider that 18 years apart, it's hardly a surprise. 12 vents compared to eight. This helmet is 35 grams lighter. And if you just look at them, look at all the extra polystyrene that was covering my head and making it just that little bit warmer. And I must admit, I did feel the extra warmth, although, as I've said before, I am still quite fond of this old helmet. Anyway, for some more GCN Does Science videos, how about clicking just up there? And for the latest GCN show, how about clicking just down here? And to subscribe to GCN, how about clicking on the coolest helmet or the globe? <laughs>